What's up everyone, it's a 5 dude back on your screen. Now in this video we'll be taking a look at when men stop simping for women part 101. So starting off we have a guy who exposed his cheating girlfriend after he set her up with his business partner. Now she actually was willing to cheat on him for only $60. This just goes to show that you cannot trust anyone. Damn. Like man that, that's... You're not. Come on. Let you me, know let what? Me see, let me check to see if you're the fish. Cause... What you do? Do what you do. Ain't none of that. Check, man. Now you know what? Let me, let me find my f***ing cousin, man. Please find something. You, let you me get this get out the way. Shot. I don't need no shot. You need something. Act like you motherfucking scared. I don't scary. need none of that. Act like you've been here before. I don't fuck for nothing. God damn. Who the f*** is at the door? Hold on, wait, chill on, I'm partner. Your partner? Yeah. Uh, this ain't, we not doing no mother train, you ain't pay for all that. Where my issue? So that's what we're doing? What are you, what are you doing? Bitch, what are you doing? That's what we're doing? You're really about to mama. Why are you doing, bro? You can't go nowhere. Why are you talking? Are you serious? You really was about to you set me up. That's cold. You yeah. set me up. It is what it set is. you up. You about to fuck my partner. Hey, I was not gonna fuck Man, you. Was I just yeah. gave you sixty dollars. I, I was not. Gonna I just him. gave her sixty dollars. I'm not no motherfucker. I just needed yeah. some attention. So this what you be doing every night when you talk about you working me? You come home every night. You don't talk to me. You go straight to the room. You. you go to the room. You so you gonna go fuck my partner? I wasn't gonna fuck him. I just needed some. Would you cheat on him with your celebrity crush? Yeah. He knows that too. That's, I do know that. How do you feel about that? It hurts a little bit, but <laughs> I do know I do know how much she loves Harry Styles. So it would it would suck and I don't know like if it actually did happen, like I don't know how I'd feel about it, but I know how much she loves him and I don't know. There is honestly nothing wrong with having a celebrity crush, but if you would actually act on it when you have a girlfriend or a boyfriend, then yeah, something's not right. If I was standing in his shoes, I would have probably dumped the girl. A powerful study, gentlemen, that I've been talking about a lot. You've probably seen it all over social media. It's done by the Census Bureau and a lot of other national data statistics centers. They're talking about what is going to happen by 2030 in terms of relationships. By 2030, 50% of women will be without a man. So that is where the West, the United States as a whole is heading towards because men ultimately want women with traditional values. Why do you think passport bros is such a big thing right now? Men want to go overseas. Then you have the other group of men, many of which comment on my channel, they're done with women and men can handle that. Do we want it? Not necessarily. So this is going to be a huge issue that women are ultimately going to have to deal with as the options cease to exist. Where have you been? I do my best. I, I, I mean, what do you do to survive? What, what is your source of livelihood? Okay. Yeah. Okay, yeah. okay. My best. When I say what do you do for a living? Okay. I mean, like, what is your job? Like, okay, my job. Yes, that okay, gives my you job. Yes. Okay, that gives me, oh, yes. oh, 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 like, financial oh, benefit. Exactly. My best. Jesus is not. Rate yourself right now. <clears throat> Hold up. Let me suck it in. All right, go for it. What would I rate my, myself? Yeah. 10, for sure. So why are we trying to suck in your stomach? Why not? Can you do it again? Okay. I rate you about a good six. <laughs> <laughs> what? what are you? Like a five? Like a two? <laughs> well, hey, um, since I gave you a six, can we hang out and kick it back? No, because I'm a 10 and 10s can't hang out with the 6. She said what? Hey, hey bro. Hey, come here. What are you rated, bro? 6. 6. See? You're ugly, though, so... But you're a 6. That's worse. This woman can clearly not handle criticism. These guys were simply just telling her the truth and yeah, she couldn't handle it. I'm Neve. Can we play? Can I guess your body count and mine? Right, go on. Uh, is your body count uh, eight? Yeah. <laughs> oh, fuck it out. I guess mine. Uh, six. Yeah. <laughs> 
All right, cute. You want to know if she's talking to someone else? Send her some flowers. Only going to cost you about $50, okay? Don't put your name under it. If she doesn't call you within 10 minutes of the dispatch telling you that it got delivered, you know what I'm saying? We can get the check whenever. Thank you. So, what are the odds you cover this? I just think it would be nice if you paid for it. Come on, don't you want to pay for the little lady? Alex, this isn't a riot date. We're friends. We can just split. This is obviously staged, but there are a lot of women out there who do use men like this. <laughs> okay, this is her date, but I can tell you the story. So the guy drove four hours to go on a date with her, and they went to eat at a restaurant, but he went into the restaurant and ate alone, and she sat in the car. I didn't want to go in. <laughs> the verdict at the end of the night is that the guy is autistic, so... They never went on a second date. <laughs> like, what's, what's bad about that? Like, it's socially awkward, fucking weird, and just not into it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so you never talked to him again after no, that? No, totally ghosted. <laughs> that is honestly just rude. Instead of ghosting him, she should have just told him that she wasn't interested. Imagine how that guy must have felt. Find the secret of a good relationship. Psychological. Psychological. So, what's psycho? Is that it? No, they're just. I'm a, logic, you're psycho. It's psychological. Psycho. Psycho. Logic. Psycho. None. Psycho. Logic. So. That's so wrong. Okay, no, I'll, I'll just do it alone. Crazy. Guys, I just got back from a hinge date. Why am I doing this to myself? So, we scheduled to go to dinner. We are sitting at the restaurant. Seems very nice, not a catfish, things are going well, and the waitress comes over, she wants to take her order, and I said, okay, I'm going to take the Branzino, and he said, I'm going to take the burger, and the waitress asked him, okay, how do you like your burger, he said, how he likes his burger, and do you want some cheese on your burger, and he asked, is this going to be extra? And she says, yes, it's $3 extra. And he said, okay, then never mind. Being over there, and I'm like, what the actual f I'm like, okay, I'm hungry. I'm going to eat my Bernzino and see what happens. And he's like, oh my God, you have to pay extra for everything these days. And I'm like, yeah, it's New York City. So I got my Bernzino. He got his burger. We were eating. And once I was satisfied, I got up. And I was like, I'm going to the restroom for a second. And I took my purse and I went to the waitress and I was like, hey, I just want to pay the bill. And I just paid the bill and walked out of the restaurant and I texted him. So I texted him, the check is taken care of. You should have gotten the cheese. And I blocked him. To be fair, I had the intention of paying $21 for this burger. So adding $3 for cheese was not all right this was it for today's video guys if you enjoyed today's video then make sure you smash that like button and yeah i will see you guys in the next one until then i'm out peace